Are you ready? Are you ready? I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems I solve them. I run through the money, depression be calling. Left all my blessings, I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage, I'm going through something. That's why I ain't calling. Phone in progression, it's all that I wanted. The phone in affection, I summon and dub it. Cause bitch, I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems I solve them. I run through the money, depression be calling. Left all my blessings. Alright, guys, so we are one game away from the final four. And we're going up against a nine seed in the in Loyola College. You know what I'm saying? On paper, we're pretty damn even, man. They slightly got us on offense. We slightly got them on defense. Slightly on rebounds, even though we don't out rebound shit. Um, we score more points than them. Get more steals, shoot better from the field. So they we get the same amount of rebounds. We get more blocks. They do shoot better from the free throw line, but that's not a surprise. We get more assists. We do turn the ball over a little bit more, and they slightly, slightly shoot better than us from three. Now, Loyola has a senior shooting guard, Stevie Haney, 6'4", 199, 17 points a game. After that, they got a senior shooting guard, Tracy Boone, a senior point guard, Gerardo Melvin, a junior point guard, Jerron Wafer, and then, you know, a couple other pieces that that helps put points on the board. For us, same old, same old, we got LSR, Abernathy, Johnson, Montreal's officially averaging 10. Harris, you know what I mean, holds his own. Crosby, he's a starter, but um, he's more of a defensive help. And uh, he, I don't think he's really scored over 10 at all this whole season. And McClung gives us a great uh, help, you know, in the paint off the bench as well. I don't think there's much left to be said, man. We are one win away from the final four and we're three wins away from winning the natty two wins away from making the natty and uh this cinder let's see if this cinderella story can continue um no like i said nothing left to say man so you guys out there on the court all right fellas let's go we got the same old same old they got a, a upperclassman heavy starting lineup we're pretty young except for LSR. He's a junior. We got two sophomores, two freshmen, and a junior. But he's a Juco junior, so he might as well be a freshman. And we turn the ball over first possession, of course. Trying to do too much, man. Great defense. All right, man. We're going to be flying around out here. Come on, Isaac. Hey, let's go. So we, we're we on the board first. Give me that. Hit the midi. Hit the midi. Let's go. This is what we do, man. You know what I mean? Don't get it twisted, fam. Cookies, no, 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 ref, stop playing, dog. Keep cutting my trail. Yes, sir. Hey. I love the way we're finishing at the rim here, man. Crosby, great defense, of course. Ah, good hop step, good hop step. They're doing a better job than Wisconsin did, you know what I mean, against the, uh, oh, good D. Against the press. Oh, we give it right back. Good defense, Isaac. Hmm, tough set. Damn. Well, you already know how we play. We. We run. We, we might turn the ball over a little bit, but this is how we give it up. Come on, Crosby. There he goes. Reset it. Come on, LSR. Keep going. I see you. Finish. Oh, what's up with us missing all these layups today, fam? Oh, I dared him to shoot it. He did. He's off, though. Of course, we don't get the board, bro. Like, tie ball game, man. Let's go. Good bounce pass. Come on, man. Oh, he ain't going to miss too many. Oh, he does miss another. Oh, of course they get bailed out. Of course they get bailed out, bro. Every time on the on the putbacks, like, we got 14 fouls already. We are two away from being in the bonus, my dude. Oh, he went for the steal, stupid. Good board, McClung. Since we can't hit shots out you. Give me that. Heat check. Let's go, Isaac. Run him off the line. Kicks it out to the wing. Get out there. <sighs> that's a kickball, first of all, ref. And that's just a dumb pass, Gary. Give me that. Should I pull it? A little step back action. Yes, sir. I see you, McClung. Oh, keep cutting. Okay, you hit it. So keep cutting and go to the basket and make a layup, bro, bro. So pass, finish that, let's go. 
Good defense, McClung. Dang. This Loyola, Loyola College team is not going anywhere, bro. Oh, Harris gets to the basket. Oh, you can't miss dunks, big dog. That's what you, you're a high flyer. You got to knock those. You got to make those. Oh, too much space. We can't give their leading scorer that much space, bro. Yes, timeout. Down two is Loyola, Loyola College. Has been on the wrong side of this long run. Work, Isaac. Tracy's got a report for us. Work, Isaac. Oh, they go for the steal. You got to hit that, though. Thank you. Isaac with the steal. And one, ref, bro. Good move, man. Good move, man. See how quickly things can change? We going to run? Ah, good deed. This is going to be a tough game, man. Even when I feel like we're, on, we're going to go on a run, we don't. Because they don't just let us go quietly. But they keep they can't leave Montreal open if they want to win. Get your position, LSR. Oh, yeah, there it is. He's a baby. He's a baby. Once you get that deep pause, it's a wrap. Good I see you, Crosby. Who's with me? Who's running with me? Is my big running with me? He is. Finishing. LSR has really come alive here, bro, in this tournament. And I love it. Honestly, I love it. Nobody told you to pick up your dribble, bro. Oh, Cohen can't shoot. Oh, he hits that window. I always say, man, if he's going to be open on the court, I got to shoot that. He shot that one with some confidence, though. They try to answer back, and they do just that. Finish the pass. Good D, fellas. We got to be able to get the rebounds, though. We got to be able to get the rebounds, though. Pushing. Finish. There we go. That's how you end the half, baby. LSR continues his hot hand. We're going into the locker room up five, bro. And uh, this has been a pretty dope game, man. I'm not going to lie. Pretty, pretty back and forth. You know what I mean? We're shooting 54%. They're shooting 64%. We both have. We're both shooting great from three, but both four for five from the free throw line. We're being out-rebounded. LSR with 14. My trail with 10. Abernathy with 11. Haney has 16 for them, so we're not doing a great job stopping their number one option. But we, we got the lead, bro. LSR is 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 that is that real deal right now here in this tournament. He's really stepping up in these big moments. All right, boys, starting off the second half with that same five point lead. Work the ball around. Let's get that good look. We're gonna we're gonna continue to go to the hot man. There he is. He had a guard on him. Don't go up soft. There we go. We got to put that pedal to the middle here in the second half, bro. Ooh, the pass got through. LSR, ah, I thought he was going to get that board. He better hit that. He does. Okay. These dudes are not backing down by any means. Come on, Montreal. Bang out. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. You want Harris want to continue to miss dunks and stuff, bro. No need to rush. Oh, I see you. That's not a charge. Okay. I was about to say, if they call a charge on him again, I'm going to be highly upset. Here we go, kid. Perfect release. Give me that. Give me that, man. Alessar is about to have 20 already, man. Slightly late. He's not, though. Not with that miss. 21. 21. Okay. Make him stop that. They don't. We're going to the rack and one ref. Y'all hate calling fouls, bro. Well, that's a lie. Y'all actually been calling a lot more fouls. Y'all been calling a little bit more tight here in the tournament. I'll, I'll give you all that much. That's a dumb pass. Oh, but it gets through. Woo, that one sneaks in. Give me that. Come on, Abernathy. Get in there. Yes, sir. Look how quickly things can change for these boys, bro. Catches it on the elbow. Haney backs down. Got us in the air. Oh, that's a good move, bro. I didn't want to foul him either, though. They now trail by 17. Pressure. Apply pressure. Left in the second half. I should have laid that up, but no rush. Uh, I'm still in this. Oh, wow. I was off. <laughs> Haney has 20 on us, but he's down 50. He's down 16, or 15, rather. Who's with me, bro? And one. Dang. Easy press to break. Get him out of here, coach. Get him out of here, coach. Wide open, coach. Come on, coach. Good pass. No, oh, don't shoot a jumper, bro. Come on, Denton. Come on, Denton. Join the fun, baby. 
21 point lead, fam. Cookies. Bang that out. Isaac, don't shoot a jumper, bro. Oh, it's a guard on us. Come on. It's a guard on us. You better finish, too. All right. 27 for LSR, bro. Let's it go. It's a lot of space. I dared him to make it, and he did. He's three for five from long range. Oh, he went for the steal and missed. It's time to show out. That ain't it. That ain't a show out. It's a weak dunk, bro. 17 point lead here. We've been beating the heck out of everybody, honestly, bro. Oh, I thought we could sneak that pass. That's an easy dunk for Haney. Haney continues to have a big game. No, we just threw that away. All right, they're pressing. Relax, guys. I didn't want to shoot that. Hell no. Y'all let that pass. Wow, bro. They're only down 11. There's enough time for them to come back, bro. Stop disrespecting these boys. There it is. Oh. Uh, they still have an 11 point lead. These dudes are on a mean run right now. Give me that good defense. Finish, Isaac. Thank you. Put that to bed right quick, man. Way to jump straight up, LSR. Give me those boards. That's only his second board of the game, yo. It's a lot of space. Make him pay. Ah. He has like a 70-something three-point shot, man. I know he can hit it. I just don't know his shot like that. Dang, man. Dudes are only down 10. Let me stop BSing. We love blowing big leads, though. I'll tell you that much. Come on, my trail. LSR on the boards. Going up like a baby. Gets another one and misses again, bruh. No threes, man. But not enough to deter him the next time. Boom. Way to be out there, Montreal. Wow. These dudes are not missing, yo. Switch, 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 switch. No. How's he wide open? Oh, my gosh. We got ourselves a game, fellas. Oh, my goodness. That's a block. They want to hoe us so bad out here, man. Whew, all right, they're down six. Shooting two. Down five, bro. Melting down here in the last two minutes. We're playing too fast. Just got to slow it up. We're not calling a timeout, though. Only down four. We got to play through this. All right, we broke the press. No need to rush it. Clock's our friend. Got to go to the hot man, though, man. Got to go to the hot man, though. Oh, they're doubling. I didn't want you to shoot that. Well, because I was, I wanted to know the pump fake before that, but it's all good, fam. LSR panicked. No twos, yo. I mean, no threes. I've been playing basketball all day today earlier. I'm so used to say no twos. He don't want that. All right. Do they foul? They do foul. Dag, man. We just, we better not go to overtime or nothing like that. I'm giving it to our hot man. I know he's the big man. He's, the, he's he's our hottest player right now. Make them foul him. I'm not passing it. I'm not passing it. Yo, he almost went out of bounds, too. One more, and they're in the bonus. Oh, he's taking the ball out now. All right, Isaac. It's up to you, baby. It's up to you, kid. I need you. Solid early, we hit the first one. We go up three. Let's go. Slightly early again, and we don't get the board. No threes. No threes. I'm here on the screen. Oh, wow. He pulled that like it was nothing. Wow, bro. And they just tied that up because we can't hit free throws. All right, we're, we're holding for the last shot. Come on, LSR. Stay hot, baby. There we go. Good D. The D. That's going to count if it goes. Woo! We tried to blow that game so badly, but LSR comes through, man. Wow, dog. 
31 points. He took 30 shots to get it, bro, but it doesn't matter, man. We're going to the Final Four. We have advanced. Oh, my goodness, dog. All right, boys. So, we tried to blow that one. Even though they, they lost, they shot 64% from the field. We hit 10-3. Even though they lost, man, they shot 64% from the field. And that's mainly because we just shot, we just shot, you know, almost 20 more shots. But we made the same amount of shots, so we made 10 threes. That saved us. We also went 10 for 13 from the free throw line. They went 10 for 11. Um, they had more assists. Uh, they had more turnovers. They out-rebounded us by 13. But we did have more offensive boards. We had more steals, of course. We had one more block. They had more points in the paint. But we had 21 fast break points. Um, their boy Haney went off for 26, and Boone gave us 31, 8, and 3. So this was a this was a tough game, dog. Like we were up big, and then they just came back. Like they outscored us in the second half. Luckily, we had the first half we had. It was just a great game, all in all. And on our side, Abernathy with 14, Johnson with 13 and 12, Montreal with 18, and Ellisar with 31, 4 and 2. We took 30 shots to get his 30, bro. But it doesn't matter when you win the game, for real. Welcome to the 2K Sports Studios. I'm Greg Dumble, along with my partner, Clark Kellogg. Coming up on the NCAA Tournament Edition of College Hoops Tonight, brought to you by State Farm, the number one auto insurer. We'll recap some of the terrific games from the Sweet 16 and Elite 8, as well as give you a preview of the upcoming action from the Final Four. But we begin with the player who gave a virtuoso performance in the second week of the tournament. Number 11 was a man among boys in the regional finals, partner, and I mean a big man. He knows what to do with the orange. We got to watch an artist at work this weekend. You got that right, partner. This had to be one of the great Sweet 16 and Elite 8 performances that we've seen. Not only was he clicking on all cylinders offensively, he matched that performance at the defensive end. He threw off the opposing game plan in the first and second round. We'll see if he keeps it going into the Final Four. Clark, the past weekend provided some incredible drama, so let's take a look at some of the most exciting contests from the Sweet 16 and Elite 8. Our first game was an outstanding matchup from the Elite 8. Memphis got the better of Michigan State. This game was so intense that I thought both teams might burn themselves out by halftime. They weren't holding anything back. And why should they? That final four spot was just 40 minutes away. Stockelford was a man possessed. His 29 points led all scores. They needed an effort like that to get this win. He saw all sorts of defensive looks, but no matter what they threw at him, he handled it and handled it well. This isn't a preseason tournament, Greg. This is the big dance. He stepped up in a way that few players can in this kind of spotlight. And for that, we should give him a big imaginary high five. Although this next game seemed predictable enough, it instead gave us one of the biggest surprises of the tournament so far. Syracuse dismantled Texas. You said it, Greg. This outcome would have seemed pretty far-fetched before the game, but it's a reality now. Texas just didn't look ready, Greg. And I don't care how inferior your opponent looks on paper. If you come out as flat as they did, especially in March, you're in trouble. Syracuse was deadly from long range. Their three-point shooting made a huge difference. I don't know if they came into this game with a plan to attack from long range, but that's definitely the way it turned out. And when you keep knocking down threes again and again like they were, it just deflates the opponent. Let's look ahead to what we've been waiting for all season, the Final Four. With the four teams we have, this should be as good a final weekend as we've seen in quite some time. This will be a fantastic battle. This is shaping up to be a prototypical style versus style matchup. Great scorers on one side of the court, great defenders on the other. This is going to be a real showdown. And the other Final Four contest should be just as riveting. This will be a fantastic battle. This is shaping up to be a prototypical style versus style matchup. Great scorers on one side of the court, great defenders on the other. This is going to be a real showdown. New Jersey Institute of Technology gets my vote, partner. They just seem to be playing at an extremely high level right now. Their ability to adapt to any style is what impresses me the most. If one thing isn't working for them, they can lean on something else without missing a beat. That'll do it for us here in the studio. For my partner, Clark Kellogg, I'm Greg Gumbel. Thanks for watching College Hoops Tonight, brought to you by State Farm, the number one auto insurer. Enjoy the Final Four. All right, boys, so the table is set. We got a Big East versus Big East Final Four matchup. 
If you guys remember in the earlier episode, we did knock off Syracuse on the road. That was a good game that came down to the last minute shot, if I if I remember correctly. So, you know, with this being a Big East rival, nothing on paper even matters, bro. Nothing on paper matters in this game at all. We got New York versus New Jersey. You know what I'm saying? Only a river. You know what I mean? Separates the two states, even though Syracuse is, you know, upstate. You know what I mean? Uh, in uh, North, you know what I'm saying? It's North Jersey. Um, but it's a big time game. Syracuse looks for some, uh, you know what I'm saying? Um, payback in a major way. And we look to punch our ticket to the national championship, bro. This is the furthest NJIT has been in any NCAA tournament. When they were D3, the furthest they got was the Elite Eight. So now that we are here in the Final Four, speaks volumes in year number two. The Cinderella run continues. And uh, will Syracuse be able to stop our thunder? I don't think so, man. But like I said, we got to come out here and play the game. So hopefully you guys are excited. And we'll see you next episode. You know what I mean? If you did and if we will, it's time to smash that like button. Hit me up in the comment section below. Subscribe if you're new. It's your boy, Uncle Sam's Reject, ArcadeGames.com. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Peace.